Hello everyone, welcome to this video. Thank you very much for clicking on it. I really appreciate it today. Uh, it's your back. As we know, you know more than I do because it's been out for hours and it came out while I was asleep, but it's fine. It's your back uh, with Mafia in the morning. Um, I, I did a reaction to the like individual member little teaser things and the highlight medley a little while ago and I did say in that that I probably wouldn't be able to get to the MV teasers and I didn't and I didn't actually check them out in my own time either. I was like, you know what? We'll save it. We'll save it for the music video itself. Um, and thankfully as well, the last couple of days I haven't been feeling very well, but I was like, please let me be better for Friday because I really want to, <laughs> I really want to be here for Itzy's comeback and we're good. I feel much better today. Um, so Thankfully, I am all good to go in terms of itsy. Um, yeah, let's do this. <laughs> all right, so all I know of this at the moment is obviously some of the like styling from the images and the individual member teasers and the snippet of the song that we heard in the highlight medley. I haven't seen the MV teasers, like I said, so I don't know really what this is gonna be like. I'm really intrigued though. Um, I'm really, really intrigued. As for the album, speaking of, um, I will be listening to that later today. That'll be over on Patreon if you want to come through and um, listen to that with me. That's where I do all my album listens. It's where my Not Shy album listen is. There's a whole bunch of stuff over there. So feel free to head on over if you want to. Um, and I will see you when I check out the album for this. Ooh, but in the meantime though, we are going to watch this music video. Mafia in the morning, three, two, one, go. Oh. Oh. Guess who loves you? Naya, na. Do I show you? No, yeah, no. Ajik, timey, anya, nan. Jumped the gag, I jumped the gag, I got the gag, I suck. I'm a silly mommy. Oh, it's different. So obviously we're going to go through this twice. <laughs> As always, Corio is on point. <laughs> Okay, you the Jesus. I love this. I have so much to say, so much to go through. <coughs> I love those shots. Oh my god. Oh, the dark lipstick look on Chae Young is it. Um, <laughs> um, love that. Love all the music videos around them. Um, okay. I, this second watch through, 
is going to take a while because I have things <laughs> to say and shit to go through. Oh my god. Firstly, first things first, if anyone knows who directed this, like the music video, please tell me because fuck me, that was incredible. Um, second, I'm obsessed with the song. I think it's my favorite of their title track releases. Um, no, I, there's no I think about it. It's 100% my favorite of their title track releases. It might even be just my favorite Itzy song that I've heard so far, but it's only after my first lesson, so I can't say that for sure. Um, this is different. This is different. Like, I feel like... Hmm. I feel like through da 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 to I see to wanna be to not shy. There's this um very much feeling of like a group growing up, right? Which makes sense. They're super young. Um and you know just look at Yuna as an example as the Monet. Like she's grown up so much over that time. Um. But yeah, over those songs, it very much feels. Uh like a like a period of growing up and it very much especially the earlier stuff i think um it it leans into that very teen crush concept right this this feels like a group that has gone through that period and is like okay now is the time where we find what our identity is as a group like no longer a rookie we're in this now let's find our identity and if this is the identity that they're going with something a little bit quirky and a little bit experimental and just fucking cool and badass and yeah i can't call this teen crush this is definitely not teen crush this is i mean to be fair not shy didn't really feel particularly teen crush either i feel like the teen crush thing kind of ended around wannabe um <clears throat> but it also doesn't feel like Girl Crush. It feels like something different. And I love that. Like, it's definitely got elements of Girl Crush. Don't get me wrong. That's kind of like the whole thing. <laughs> but it feels, it just, it just, it, it feels different. And if this is the identity that they start leaning towards, I am 100% on board for it. Um, if they're starting to, if they want to play with sounds and styles and all of that stuff, I'm, I'm on board. Um, ooh. Oh, damn okay right yeah we're gonna go through this again like i said this is gonna take some time because i've got i've got shit i want to talk about i want to talk about the music video i want to talk about the chore i want to talk about the vocals and the rap i want to talk about the um, the actual music production like we're gonna dissect this bad boy um so if you want to leave now <laughs> because you've seen the initial reaction by all means leave that's fine but if you want to see me break this down and talk about this in more, some more detail buckle in grab a snack let's do this Whew! okay so first up this it's like it's like the i don't know because it's it's kind of like binoculars like you've got the like tunnel vision right it's also kind of like the barrel of a gun which i guess you know is probably what it's meant to represent um because of the um and the you know at the beginning the shot that was fired off um but it also kind of looks like um that you know in like oh, certain like older films or tv shows where it's sort of like a whodunit kind of thing and they'd have the magnifying glass like going over and it would highlight different parts like in like a credit sequence kind of thing that's what that reminds me of like a like a magnifying glass um and it's just it's really really cool and then yeah Ujin as one of the mannequins And then, okay, 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 okay. So, instrumentally, instrumentally. So, I love this. Ding, 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 ding. Like, that's really, really cool. But then you've also got, like, that's like the high tone side of it. And then you've got this lower tone, like, do, 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 do. it's really it just, it feels like it's, I think the high tone stuff is in one ear and the lower tone is in the other. And it just, I don't know, man. It creates this really cool dynamic. I love, I love the fucking editing. The editing in this music video, I am obsessed with. Like, I love that. I love that. I love that so much. Let me... I want to just 
yeah so it's like they like oh that's so cool so we obviously have her here and then they zoom out on these mannequins and then it's zoom out oh and the mannequins are like the store window that's so cool and then there she is and then that outfit in itself is amazing and then the rest of the girls come through as this is building up i'm so here for it i just love the way they edit them in i think it's so freaking cool like because they're like Phoom. it's literally like magic <laughs> like <laughs> it's so cool um like they teleported in um but yeah and then this this build up this build up Let's go, you know. And they brought... Oh, I didn't say at the beginning. I didn't say at the beginning. For anyone new here and doesn't know, I am double biased in this group with Cheyoung and Yeji. Just FYI. <laughs> the fucking choreo! Like, the thigh strength. I love these vocal moments. Like, it's a very, very rap-heavy song, right? But the vocals just sound so good. Um, and yeah, Leah, you're beautiful. And we've got this, oh, oh, I forgot about that vocal. Ah, <laughs> this is what I mean. There's a lot that I want to talk about. Um, but you've got this, like, you've got this build up, this tick 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 um, There it is. But then, yeah, at the end of this line, it just, oh, it's so pretty. The freaking choreo! I've got to assume this might be the same director or at least team in some regard behind not shy behind god's menu and behind backdoor um for stray kids because there's definitely some similarities in the editing here um and the way the camera moves um i don't know let me know i might be wrong i love the teleporting editing <laughs> I love that bit. I love, I love, I love a bit like this. I love a magic trick um, with just, just camera work. Like it just, I mean, it was also editing cause she changes outfit, but like, I love that shit. I just, I'm so obsessed with that. Ding, 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 ding. It, it is such an earworm. Ah, the energy. <laughs> oh, I just saw what they did there. So she pulls down like the cloth. And then Ujin like chucks it off. Love that. And there's a vocal mod in there. There's a vocal mod happening in that instrumental. It sounds real cool. That that gold look on the uh, is quite something. I wasn't sure how I felt about it when I first saw it, but you know what? I'm kind of obsessed. Mm. It's so catchy! This, that choreo is insane. <sighs> you know I love that shit. You know I love that kind of choreo and I love how the camera goes between their heads. That melody she sings. Mm. This bridge is so good. <laughs> this bridge is so good. Mm. 
Uh, I'm obsessed with the way she sings that so much, but then this back and forth with her and Lujin. And that, that is so cool. So here's something that I, I, I don't know if, I mean, no, I'm sure there are other people that, that notice this, but it's something that I use to measure, like, how fluid is a dancer? Um, and I feel like it's a way that you can, in some ways, sort of, like, figure out, like, it's one of those things that I look for when I'm like, okay, who are the main dancers in this group? Like, if I'm trying to, if I'm trying to clock who the main dancer is in a group, I don't know, right? Um, and the, the thing that I look for is hip movements because someone who is a very, very, very well-trained dancer, like Yezi or Taeyang, I mean, they're all great dancers, don't get me wrong, but especially those two, um, will have very, very strong, very fluid hip movements. And this is just such an excellent example of it. Like she just, like Taeyang just like says, hip, 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 it's great. <laughs> You know what else as well? I feel like um, in previous eras, there's always been like one member or one or two members that have really stood out ahead of the others, right? I feel like for Dada Dada Yeji was um, a big standout um, in Icy, Yuna, um, Wannabe, Ujin, um, for Not Shy. I think there was, a, there was a couple with Not Shy, like it just sort of depended on the day. Um, but for this, I can't really pick out any particular one person that stands out more than the others. I feel like they all stand out for some reason or another. Um, and I love that. I love that shit. Um, it, th this feels this feels so different not even just in terms of sound and style of the music video and all of that sort of stuff they just feel so much more oh, um secure like like what i was saying earlier about them finding like an identity this feels like a like like the previous releases were all great but it was sort of them like f putting the feelers out and trying some different things this feels like this is it see you know? I don't know if anyone else feels that, but this just feels so solid. And I don't know, it's really, it's a really interesting feeling, but I'm so here for it. Anyway, I'm gonna, I'm gonna bring this one to an end. <laughs> if I can keep this under 20 minutes, success. Um, but I, I'm absolutely obsessed with that. I love the song. As you can probably tell, I could already sing along, which is the, the, the mark of a great hook. Um, because that's exactly what a hook is meant to do, <laughs> hence the name Hook. Um, but yeah, no, I, I, I love this song so much. I think the music video is honestly awesome. Um, whoever edited that, mwah, great job. Like, go and have a drink and celebrate because you did an amazing job. Um, and yeah, I cannot wait, cannot wait to go and listen to this album. I'm going to do that as soon as I possibly can because I, and I, you know, I always need some more itsy b-sides in my life. Um, and I feel like their b-sides have just been getting better and better and stronger and stronger. So I'm really excited for this. But yeah. I'm gonna end this one here. Let me know what you guys thought of it. Um, I'd be really intrigued to know how this compares to previous tracks for you. Um, like, you know, everyone, everyone's, everyone's favorite title track for any group is a very personal thing, I feel like. Um, and I feel like for me, objectively, this feels like their strongest song, but I've only listened to it twice so far. Um, and I think personally, this is my favorite of this, of their title track so far. So I'd be really intrigued to know what you guys think as well. Um, but yeah, anyway, I'm going to end this one here. Thank you guys very much for watching. I will catch you in the next one. Bye-bye.